At first glance, the beach off Liberia's vast West Point settlement seems like paradise. Until you look closer. The sand is covered in trash. Children play between mounds of detritus, hurling jars of old hair product into the waves. Many here and across Liberia's capital, Monrovia, say a lack of waste management has become a full-blown crisis. They get the garbage from their homes, they take it to the beach as a place of dump, uh, a dump site. Archie Bizet is a West Point resident and community activist. Yo. He says it's a serious health hazard and a threat to marine life. But our capacity in terms of addressing these situations are somehow limited, very limited. And central government is in no way having a kind of uh, mindset of in any sort of a form to come and address the kind of plight we are faced with as community people. However, removing the rubbish is currently a challenge. There are only three designated dump sites in Monrovia and just a few garbage trucks with sporadic collection times. Mayor of Monrovia Jefferson Koiji says there are plans to expand the truck fleet and make collections regular. 120 waste monitors have also been hired for the worst affected areas. But he says everyone needs to get involved. I don't find comfort in presiding over a dirty city. I don't find pleasure in being questioned about your city being disorganized. But it is not me. It is not me. It, it is circumstances beyond unforeseen circumstances. And those circumstances is contingent on the share and collective responsibility and understanding of we. One person who agrees is businesswoman Vivian Barty. Ahead of bicentennial celebrations earlier this year, she hired a team to clear trash from some of the busiest streets. So I decided to give a good office there that will be able to showcase the cleanliness and uniqueness of Liberians. Barty says it's up to Liberians to take the initiative. She and Bizet, who is working to raise awareness, are among Monrovian residents taking matters into their own hands as they seek to turn back a tide of trash.